Welcome. This video will show you how to integrate Ninja Trader with our Cycle Analysis Toolbox. So first of all, in order to get the scripts which will run in Ninja Trader, please switch to the um, Build Integrate Your Apps section once you have logged into the Cycle Tools and click the Ninja Trader link. This will take you to a page where you can download the pre-built Ninja Trader scripts here. So once you've downloaded um, the scripts, you will have a local file called Cycle Explorer Indicator uh, for Ninja Trader 8. So this zip file can then afterwards be imported in your Ninja Trader. So let's show you how to do this. So just open your Ninja Trader um, and import a new script. So a Ninja script add on. Once you've clicked the import section, you can then um, switch to the folder where you have saved uh, the file which you have previously downloaded from the integration link and then just simply open the zip file which was included um, in the download. Click OK and then the new script will show up in your NinjaTrader platform. So once you've imported this script into NinjaTrader um, you will be able to run the Cycle Explorer um, from your Ninja Trader data feed. So that's okay. So now we have uh, integrated the script into Ninja Trader here. So we can close the um, file here. And now, in order to apply um, our Cycle Explorer to a chart, so now you can use also intraday data and apply cycle analysis. This is a Bitcoin Euro chart here in a one minute time frame. You see it's a live chart here. So if you want to now pull the Cycle Explorer on through intraday or chart here, just open the indicator sections with an India trader and now you will find here down below the VTT at, at WTT Cycle Explorer as a new indicator. So just add it um, and now in order to get it activated and run on your chart, you must now just give it your AP key which you will find in your Cycle Explorer toolbox. So in order to get your AP key, um, visit your Cycle Explorer dashboard open your account pane here in the navigation tab and then visit the AP key um, navigation. You can do the same going into the build section here on your dashboard and browsing then to your API key. So once clicking here you will find your individual API key here listed in this column here. If not create a new one or if I'm sharing the key like that you should afterwards create a new one for sure. So just grab this key with copy and paste and then bring this over to your Ninja Trader indicator here and just copy and paste the key here. Then you just can indicate how much bars you want to plot in the future. Uh, it's a one minute bar and you can apply this indicator to your chart. And you see down below here that the Cycle Explorer is now automatically calculated um, and also be rebuild um, every minute. So uh, as you see new bars coming in, um, the Cycle Explorer will update automatically, bring up a new Cycle Explorer. So this is not a static indicator, it will update once new data is coming in. So this shows you how the integration between the Cycle Analysis Toolbox and our API, which is documented here. So now Ninja Trader is using the Cycle's Cycle Explorer endpoint, which is also documented here on the platform with this information here. So it's it's the simple integration of our API with a pre-built indicator you're now running and in Ninja Trader. If you want to dig deeper into the uh, um, script here for sure, the script is open so you can edit, squeeze and change it on your own. So it's not a closed script here. You can see it in your indicators within Ninja Trader. And you can open the Cycle Explorer here so you can see that this is the call to the API cycle.tools and it's using the endpoint Cycle Explorer here. So it's a pre-built script, script which allows you to run the Cycle Explorer with a Ninja Trader with just some simple click. Thanks.